Hey guys, I'm at the airport right now. Um, I guess it's time for me to tell you guys what's going on with me. Um, I've got this opportunity, this very exciting opportunity. Um, I just had to take it. Um, I'm going to training in Salt Lake, Utah to become a flight attendant. Very exciting. I'm so excited. I'm just so happy and I'm very blessed to have this opportunity. And so this is why I'm at the airport. I'm on my way to Salt Lake City, Utah. I'm actually waiting for my friend because she's going to training with me. She got the, um, the offer as well. So she's coming and she'll be here in an hour. So yeah, um, I can't really tell you guys what airline we're going to work for because it's company policy. And for those of you guys that know, um, I'd have to ask you guys to please not um, say what airline I work for. Um, but yeah, so I, we want to do a video for you guys um, to do like vlog during training. Um, it's gonna be a short training well it's gonna be a month training so I'll try to do videos every day um, if not forgive me but I will try my best I will very very try my best to do some video vlogging every day and um, so hopefully you guys just keep following me watch my videos and I'll try to do my best to give you guys videos every day um, yeah, so if being flight attendant is your dream, um, I recommend to just keep going until you do have your foot in the door. Um, if it's something that you really, really want, don't ever give up. Keep going, keep trying for it, keep applying for it. Um, that's my advice for you guys. So yeah um, so I'm gonna do another video when my friend gets here so I will talk to you guys in a little bit yeah, no worries. <laughs> Woo, finally made it to Salt Lake City Salt Lake City <laughs> it's hot <laughs> you can see I'm shiny <laughs> oily <laughs> How long were we traveling? We were traveling for like seven hours. Long day. We stopped by San Francisco. And now we're going to our hotel. Pray we get beds. <laughs> <laughs> That's David. Nice to meet you, YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. We'll get back to you guys when we get to the hotel. Bye! Peace. Say bye! Bye! <laughs> Say bye! Bye! <laughs> bye! Hey guys, so I'm finally here in my room and oh god, I'm so tired pulling those luggage that I have. But um, uh, I'm gonna take, give you guys a tour of the room that I have. So this is the kitchen, um, it has an oven, uh, stove top, microwave, fridge, empty fridge, and a little dining table, and this is the living room, a little study table, couch. Um, TV and this is the bedroom I don't know if I have if I have a roommate but my roommate is not here yet um, this is the bathroom it's a walk-in bathroom so 
it's a pretty good size um, closet. And then let's see what view I have. So that's my view. You can open it. I want to. This is day one of flight attendant training and it's been a long day. I forgot to finish my pre-training uh, the day before video. So, but I'm still gonna, I still posted it just so you guys can see. But um, um today, I have to wake up about 4 in the morning to get to the training facility at by, by 6.30 and we started at 7. <clears throat> so our, we sign up for a shuttle or, um, when we get here after class and you have to sign up for shuttle the day before. For, for tomorrow for tomorrow so you don't miss your scheduled shuttle to the training facility because you don't want to be late for the training and if you're late then you probably get to go home so for those of you who are wanting to become a flight attendant make sure you're not late um, so today we had our entrance exam today I passed it with a hundred so that was cool hundred percent um there were there were six people that had to go home today do that um, I got to know them and they were my friends so just pretty sad um, Make sure when you, before you apply to become a, f a flight attendant, make sure that you read through the requirements and what they are looking for, especially with tattoos. They're very strict with tattoos. So um, make sure you don't have any tattoos that would be visible. For example, can't have anything on your arm or on your wrist. And your fingers um, you can't have anything that shows over here on your neck or the back of your neck um, just you just can't be visible so just keep that in mind when you're wanting to apply for flight attendant <coughs> but anyway um, it was a 10-hour class today and it was very exhausting to much information they throw at you on the first day but we don't require to memorize it the first day so that's pretty good I just had a hard time trying to stay awake and if they catch you trying to fall asleep um, you're probably going to be sent home so you don't want to try to fall asleep you have to stay awake you know anyway um, so Right now, I am just relaxing. Do have some homework for tomorrow. Um, get to go on the Walmart run for, because I do have a kitchen so I can cook um, food. Um, that's about it for today. It's about 5.15 Mountain Time. <sighs> I'm gonna relax. I don't leave. My child doesn't leave to go to Walmart for another hour. So I'm probably gonna study, do my homework, eat something. So when I go to the store, I don't buy the whole store. You know how that goes. Um, yeah, it's just been very exhausting. I have to go to bed early. Make sure when you guys do get a chance to go to training. 
go to bed early like seriously because if you get caught sleeping like I said before you probably get sent home so I'm gonna go to bed early tonight make sure I do my homework for tomorrow and that's it so come I'll um, after I do my Walmart run I'll show you guys what I buy it's gonna be my food for the whole 10 days since they only take us two runs to Walmart I think or I can always take an Uber but I don't know if I'll have time but anyway so all right guys I just got back from Walmart and bought a few stuff that'll last me for 10 days um let me show you what I got so I got some water I got some steak, some vegetables, some romaine lettuce, tomatoes, green bell peppers, some cucumbers, mushrooms, cheese, some fruits, some cherry, those are good, some ranch. Your, your vitamins and some breakfast tuna, corn, uh, dried salt, olive oil, and some sriracha. <laughs> and then I got some bread as well. So, so yeah, that's what I got, and it should last me for 10 days. Um, if not, I'm pretty sure it'll last me for 10 days. <laughs> I don't, I mean, I eat, but I don't really, like, I know how to portion my food, so it'll last me for 10 days. So, yeah. I'm so ex exhausted, but I have to do some homework. Um, but I'm going to end the night, I'm going to end the video here. So, yeah. That was my day, and tomorrow we get our badges. Um... So we're, we'll be official tomorrow with our badges. Um, and not sure what else we're doing tomorrow. I think we're going to have a tour in the hangar. Hangar? Hangar? I, I can't even pronounce it. But um, yeah, I think that's what we're going to do tomorrow and more more information they want to throw at us tomorrow for 10 hours so i gotta i have to have at least eight hours sleep to stay awake for tomorrow have to so i'm gonna study for an hour and then go to bed um yeah so i'll talk to you guys later